What's up, everybody? It's another episode of the Missonians and Thoughts from RJ the Beast. And today, I'm going to talk a little bit about education. And I'll kind of give you a backstory a little bit. <clears throat> you know, I'm an educated person. I'm, I'm a degreed person in criminal justice. Um, but when I was younger, I kind of went to school when I thought feasible to go to school. Um, you know, and I tried my hardest to stay motivated and dedicated, but I was dealing with a lot of things when I was younger and it made it real, real hard to get up every morning and go. I did go on to college at a young age and I did play a little bit of college ball, but I never gave my full potential to myself and to my life. And now as I got older, I decided to go back to school and I did get my degree. I have two degrees in criminal justice, um, one of them being in criminal, criminal law. But, you know, I've always went off of these goals and these things, these main things on why I thought education was important. And the first one was, you know, you, you have to have an education to be happy. I mean, really happy, you know, happy in your life, happy that you have a stable life. You know, if you want to lead a real happy life, you have got to be educated in some way. And I'm not saying that people that don't go to college, um, you know, aren't, aren't happy. I'm just saying that you have to give yourself reasons to be happy for yourself. And one of those I chose was education. Um, you know, you, you start your career off of, you know, what you love. Most of the people do. They start the career off of things they love and they start careers off of, off of things that, that really helps them get that motivation. And in my case is working with young people, but you know, in order to get a perfect career for yourself, Education is important. You know, education is what brings on happiness, even in a job setting. <clears throat> but the next thing, and, and what most people think of being important, which is not very important to me because family is the most important thing to me, is money. <clears throat> you know, being educated, you know, and being an educated person, it gives you an opportunity to take more chances and with those chances might come more money you know and a lot of, I, I think a lot of people look for high paying jobs and they look for high paying careers but they never realize that you know you got to have a one up you got to have a step you got to have another ladder and with that you know gives you more chances it opens up more doors it gives you more opportunities to step through to make more money <clears throat> you know most people will agree a lot of money could be a route to evil you know, uh, people that are fortunate enough to be rich or well off are not very happy. They're lonely. They're depressed. You know, so, you know, it's it's not always good to fight to be rich. I don't want to be rich. <clears throat> I just want to be educated. And with education comes better opportunity. And I'll just leave it at that. Um, you know, you, you have to give yourself opportunity. And with the opportunity can come more money. But money needs to be the last thing on your list. You got to find something to make you happy. You got to find something to make you open up your eyes and drive towards your goals. <clears throat> you know, the next thing I want to talk about is with education, sometimes comes equality. You have to be able to open doors for yourself. <clears throat> okay. And when I say equality, I mean that you want to see the world through eyes of equals. You know what I mean? And you give yourself a chance to do that by being educated. You have to know the difference between right and wrong. You have to know the difference between, you know, what to say, what not to say. And I'm not saying the uneducated people are like that. But what I'm saying is when you're educated, you make your mind strong. It really helps to see things clear and fair and open and be able to make your own your own decisions and your own outlooks and your own judgments on things. And, and, and really educated people have an opportunity to be better people. They have an opportunity to see things in a better light, see things that, that most people might not see. <clears throat> but with that comes being dependent, you know, to be self-dependent means education has got to be important. Who doesn't want to be self-dependent? You know, self-dependent people are important people in the world because they don't need a whole bunch of things. They don't need a whole bunch of people around them to be successful. They can figure out their own ways to make it, figure out their own ways to get through things that most people can't. <sighs> education is something that you really have to work towards. It wasn't an easy thing for me. 
It was a struggle. It was making time. It was putting more effort, but it made me wiser. <clears throat> it made me wiser to the things in the world. It made me wiser into my own self. It made me more intelligent towards what to look for when I'm pushing towards my goals. And I had a dream. <clears throat> I had a dream to be working with young people and to be able to change young people that had a life like mine, and to be able to change young people that had nobody in their lives to be supportive, to be able to change young people's views, and to be able to change their, 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 their future into something positive when all they know is something negative. And guess what? Education has made my dream a reality. It's made my dream come true because I have the opportunity to work with young people. I have the opportunity to open eyes that are blind. <clears throat> more education means more peace. More education means a safer world. Educated minds are not hostile minds. Educated minds are not about negativity. Educated minds are about positivity. They're about seeing the world open. <clears throat> They're about helping poverty, helping the less fortunate. Educated people find ways to deal with problems in the world. And in order to open your eyes and see these problems and make an effort to fix these issues, education can make you more confident. It can build bridges that you don't normally have. Okay? <clears throat> it can, it can, it, you know, a degree is like saying you have proof that you're knowledgeable, right? But the paper itself you get from a college. The, the, the diploma you get from a high school is nothing if you're not knowledgeable. That paper is just saying you have the knowledge to be successful. <laughs> and it doesn't matter what you do. It doesn't matter if you struggle. It doesn't matter if it's hard. You always find a way to keep moving forward. Another thing that I think is with a good education, education, edu education, and as a whole, and educated people as it helps society, <clears throat> okay? <laughs> because people will speak the unspoken words. People will view the things that are not normally viewed by people. People will see <clears throat> issues in their society, in their towns, in the world that people don't normally want to see. But with that, with issues you see, there's such a bigger chance to contribute to fixing these things if you're educated. <clears throat> and I'm not perfect. I never said I was perfect. I waited too long to go back to school. But I know there's things that education brings <clears throat> to make you an active member of your town, the world, society, everything. It makes you see things so much clearer. It makes the future so much brighter. <clears throat> Not only that, but with education, comes a bigger mind it, it opens up doors in your mind it makes you think harder businesses can be open self-employed people build small businesses in the big corporations which means we help growth economically <clears throat> and with that brings money to small towns brings money to bigger areas and smaller areas money in a society is different than personal money like my own because it helps people as a whole. <clears throat> Lastly, being educated helps people from being fooled or cheated out of things in their life. <clears throat> it saves people from being exploited. It saves people from being fooled into thinking that some things are real when they're not. We live in a country we enjoy for a number of rights and freedoms that we have. It's easier to take advantage of innocent or illiterate people. So we have to stay educated. You know, there may be traps set that, that fool you into signing false documents or, or, or make it to where we're deprived of our rights and our freedoms. <laughs> but an educated person will understand these things. An educated person will be aware of their rights and their freedoms. And it'll make them stand tall. And it'll make them speak their minds on an educated level. 
<clears throat> so you take what I say today and you understand that these are just thoughts from RJ. But you guys all have your own thoughts. And you guys leave me a comment and you let me know what you think. Because I'm more than happy to go over these topics with you. I'm more than happy to answer questions. And you leave me a comment <clears throat> and tell me what you think. So anyway, like this video, turn on the notifications, leave me a comment and tell me what you think. Please share this video and I will see you soon. Once again, this has been an episode of the Missonians and thoughts from RJ the Beast. Let me know what you think. Peace.